Hi, and welcome to another video in the series for the 37 sensor kit from Key Studios. Uh, this is what the kit looks like. And we're going to be talking about the joystick module, which goes right, right here. Okay, I'm sure you're all familiar with what a, a joystick is. It's been around forever. It's been used in video games since I can remember. Uh, but now that uh, we can use it with our Arduino, uh, you, can, you can use this uh, to program your robot to, to steer it. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do here is go over to the computer and we're going to look at the Key Studios wiki. They have a description here and specifications and here's the connection diagram. So with this up, we're going to go back over and uh, hook up our, our uh, joystick. We have uh, five uh, wires, positive ground, and then uh, X, Y, and what they're calling Z in the code, which is actually a, a digital button. Okay, so we have uh, first the blue. Blue is going to be Y. And then next is yellow. It's going to go into X. And then it's marked B uh, on, the, on the board. It's going to be purple. And then we have plus, minus. Okay, I'm going to just stick it right here. Okay, now we're going to hook it into the Arduino. Um, I'll plug in my power first. So it's going to go into the 5 volts, fourth one over. Ground is right next to it. Okay, and then uh, the purple, the digital button, is going to be in pin 3, which is the fourth uh, slot over here. Okay, and then they have the yellow going into a zero. And then the blue right next to it. Okay, so now that it's wired up, we're going to go back over to the computer and uh, download the code. So they have some sample code here that I'm using. Um, I am remoting into my Raspberry Pi, which is connected to the Arduino. Uh, you could uh, connect your Arduino directly to your computer. Uh, it makes very little difference as far as what we're going to do. Okay, so I'm going to remote in using my VNC session. Okay, and uh, I'm going to open up the Arduino IDE. Okay, we have a blank sketch open, so here's where you would uh, paste in the sample code. I'm going to open my code, which is on, on my Raspberry Pi. Okay. I'm going to close this old window here and make this bigger so I can see it. Okay, so we're uh, defining some variables x, y, and, and z. And uh, the z is, is the button, so that's going to be an input. Uh, the serial begin that sets up the the serial monitor which is this bu button over here and then we're going to go into a loop and it's just going to keep checking 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 to see if you've moved anything or pressed a button and then it's going to display the results on the screen okay so uh, every time you're going to check these things the board is connected to the, uh, the the board that you're using so we're using an uno here and the port is to the uh, correct port um, that you're plugged into, your USB, uh, usually be marked with what's plugged into it. And then we're going to upload to the board, which is this button over here. Okay, once we're done uploading, we're going to open up the serial monitor so we can see the results of what's happening with the joystick. This is, uh, th these are the values when it's just sitting, obviously. So now I'm going to start moving the button or the joystick. Um, if, you, if you push it forward, that's the Y. And you can see the, the middle number going from 0 to home is 5, 20, 21. And then all the way down is uh, 10, 23. When I move it this way, 
to the left or right, it's uh, zero. Home is 524, and all the way to the right is 1023. And then when I push it, you can see that one flying by right there. Okay, so um, now that that's hooked up, you could you could uh, take those numbers in your program and uh, do whatever you want with them. Control your robot or, or whatever uh, you might want to do with them. So uh, there you have it. See you in the next video.